taste testing some pre-made moonshine cocktails. I don't even know what you would call this. Anyway, as you can tell, I have, I have, and other people have already gotten into some of these and tasted them. This one, and this one, Wild Cherry, and Blue Houdini are terrible. But they're so bad, you just have to keep going back to them. It's like a bad smell. You just keep... <laughs> you can't believe it's actually that bad. So again, let's try it. I'm not going to be drinking all of these because I've got other things to do today. Yep, the smell is what I remember. so bad. Oh god, it's terrible. I think this one's worse today. Today this one's worse. Oh god. Oh, it's so bad. Okay, I really need to wash my mouth out. Oh god, it's worse. It's worse. Because now there's a lot more of it. Oh god, that's so bad. Oh my god. Oh, it's so terrible. That's so bad. That's so bad. Oh my god, that's terrifying. That's so bad. Oh my god, what does that even taste like? It's like... cherry taste to it. I love cherry taste. They've perfected artificial cherry flavoring. Red Starbursts, red Jolly Ranchers, red Airheads, all the best flavors. Why wouldn't you just do that if you're mixing moonshine stuff? That's, oh god, that's terrifyingly bad. Okay. This one, Butterscotch. Actually, you know what? Let's save Butterscotch. Let's go in ascending order of goodness. This one is apple pie. Very super cold. 
classic moonshine flavor. But I'm not a huge fan. Let's check it. Yep, exactly what I remember. It's not bad. It's just that they took everything about an apple pie moonshine type thing and they made it worse. They were like, okay, we're going to use low quality moonshine. That's not really very good. It's not terrible, but it's not good. We're going to use low quality uh, apple cider to mix it with. Not very good. And then we're going to use like, I don't know, low quality sugar and low quality, you know, cinnamon and just throw it together and we'll call it done. It's not good. It's not horrible. It's totally drinkable. But I would never pay for this. Never in a million years would I pay for this. Butterscotch. say this is better than both of them. If you really, really love butterscotch, maybe stick with just that, but otherwise, this is good. Now, okay, I've got some coffee here. This is for the next ones. These two are actually good. Uh, moon pie, coconut cream. I've never had a moon pie. Is that supposed to be coconut flavored? Moonshine, chocolate milk, and moon pie. This one tastes exactly to my mind of Bailey's. Yeah, I maybe get a tiny bit in that one sip of coconut flavoring, but to be honest, not. I think it's meant to be mixed. So let's put a little bit in our coffee. You could have set this up better. You really could have set this up better. You could have also had a larger workstation. Let's check. Don't spill, don't spill, don't spill. Okay. I think that's, that's a good color. Super nice. Oh my goodness. Oh my. Oh my goodness. That's super nice. Holy crud. That's insanely good. All right. Cleanse our palate. If you're wondering why I'm 
rushing through this, it's because I'm leaving town and I have to get through like five more videos after this. So we're getting one every day. No spell, no spell, no spell, no spell, no spell, no spell. Okay, this is supposed to be chocolate milk. suffer. Let's mix this and this. And then because all this stuff's just gonna get tossed. Oh my goodness. Let's just mix mixy moxy everything together. That's kind of a nice little color. Let's see what kind of a purple we can make. Oh god, stop. Stop doing that. You know what? With the cream really cuts it back and actually doesn't taste terrible. We did not get... Ah, we got a little bit of a purple. It's not terrible. Oh, we're knocking it down this whole thing. No way. Uh, yep, that's bad. That's bad. Oh, God. That's it. 